Asincor Energy in the news recently. Asincor trades on the Toronto Venture Exchange under the symbol AAZ and on the OTC is AZURF. So they have a VTEM server that generated seven new target areas, the East Preston Uranium Project. I've got with me now Alex Clement, President and CEO. Hey Alex, why don't you run through this one? Looks like some good news here. Uh, more target areas, huh? Yeah, Asincourt uh, announced today uh, our results from the uh, geophysical survey, airborne geophysical survey we did in February. Uh, essentially, it's added uh, seven target areas, and within those target areas, there are multiple drill targets. So we've uh, our target inventory has grown exponentially over the last uh, year. Um, the project is 25,000 hectares. It's jammed full of drill target. Um, drill targets, which is exactly what you want to see. Um, these are um, basement-hosted uh, conductors where, where you're looking for uranium. Uh, we're in the right area. There's $20 billion worth of market caps around us, giants like uh, NextGen and Orano Canada um, and, you know, uh, Cameco all in the area. So uh, there's little Asincourt in the middle of it. And uh, over the past month, we've had a lot of institutional money come into Asincourt which is amazing to me, um, simply because we're waiting for drill results, and this money's coming in before we even announce those drill results, uh, which tells me that these institutional um, professionals, if you will, are making bets uh, in the sector. Um, and it's not about the first couple of holes we drill. It's about where we could be in a year with that many targets and where they feel the uranium sector is going. So, uh, yeah, good news for, for Asincourt. Today, um, uh, we announced uh, additional targets, so our, our 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 shelves are stocked, if you will, and uh, we're open for business. Okay, Alex Clemman, President, CEO, Asincor Energy, AAZ on the venture, AZURF on the OTC, and we'll certainly look forward to checking back with them when they have some more news.